Hi guys, this is the Tech Girl 007 here. I hope you're all doing well. So today I'm going to be showing you guys on how to actually download DaVinci Resolve 17. Right, okay, so just before installing, I just wanted to let you guys know that if you're worried about switching to DaVinci Resolve 17 from 16 and thinking whether the installation to the new version will delete all the extras you have got such as titles or transition packs the short answer is no and i will tell you why at the end of this video that is so that i don't waste much of your time if you're just wanting to get started with davinci resolve 17 installation and if you have encountered an issue such as this i'll just show you guys how you could fix that at the end of the video So to do that, we want to go onto Google and search for install DaVinci Resolve. Right, so once you've searched for it, you should get a website called Black Magic Designs. So if you go here, it says DaVinci Resolve 17. Right, so once you're on the website, go down and select download now. And from here, you've got a few options. So I'm going to go and select DaVinci Resolve 17 Beta. Obviously, because it's in beta version right now. So I'll just go for Windows and I'm using Windows. So you just want to click on Windows. Right. So now it's asking you all your details. So like your name, your last name, your company. If you have it, you don't have to put it because it's not got like a star next to it. Your email address, of course, your phone number, your country and everything. Basically, you just want to be filling in everything. So you have to do it. If you don't do it, you won't be able to download it. It's just because it wants you to, for example, register and download it. Right, so once you have clicked on register, you should be able to get a page something like this. It's basically thanking you for downloading the program and then you should see something as such at the bottom of your screen. It's basically a zip file and then once it's got installed or downloaded, you want to go here and say show in folder. Then you want to create another folder, just I'll just call it dev. D A V just to be precise and I want to bring this here so now open it and then in here just right click and select extract so you want to say extract and then just wait for it to extract this is obviously going to take some time so just be patient and it should be done as soon as possible and then it should just start extracting and showing the percentage next to it so as you can see we're nearly at 59% and it's just going on and on until it's reached 100% so once you've extracted the files you'll see this file appearing in DAV folder so you just want to double click on it now, if you're prompt with a window that's asking you to press yes or no, you just want to press yes. And from here, just leave everything as it is and just click on install. And on this window, just click on next, accept the terms of conditions, click on next, next, and then install. And now just press on finish. As you can see that the installation has been completed and you just want to click on OK. And here it is on the desktop, you just want to double click on it to open it. It may take some time because it's the first time that you have just downloaded it. So let's just wait for it. 
so once you double click on it you get a welcome tour in here so if you want to go through it because it's your first time using it you can just go or you can say skip tour I'm just gonna say welcome tour so you guys can have a feel of what it's like if you're using it for the first time this is basically showing you what all the stuff are so this is about the media in here and your editing tracks so like all the other techniques as well just want to say next 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 and you can then go on to say quick setup otherwise just say skip and start right away let's talk about why all your plugins will not delete so the reason it's not going to all delete or get messed up is because once you have downloaded DaVinci Resolve 17 it's basically going to ask you whether you want it to update or upgrade and you want to just click on the options whichever that it gives you and that basically will set itself up with all your plugins and everything in place and just in case if there are any that were not working that basically means that those programs that you've downloaded have not yet upgraded to DaVinci 17 so they haven't really updated the software yet all right so that's what it is right so it says in here update configuration so since the update some people get this issue with their graphics card so it's basically a GPU configuration warning you just want to click on update configuration then you want to go to memory and GPU uncheck both of these and then just check this one so it's my graphics card in here I'm just basically selecting my graphics card otherwise by default it was selecting something else which it wasn't recognizing and then what you want to do is basically click on save and you get this basically click ok and then try opening DaVinci again and that should basically solve that issue right so okay here we go it has now opened and you can basically use it as normal alright guys so I hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe like and share this video and I shall see you on another video take care bye